Hey guys, Too Legit City here. Today we're going to be talking about a meta refinery cheese strat slash exploit in the game of oxygen not included. So to get it started, we're going to need to get a meta refinery. Your pipeline layout should look something like this. The goal is we're going to be looping the output water back into the intake. And what we're going to want to do is specifically break this pipeline. So what you're going to want to do is click on the output pipe, the green, and click disable auto repair. So once it breaks, it stays broken. So that's going to be the first thing. Second thing is my meta refinery is only filled up around 400 kilograms. This is because we want to loop the water and give it space to loop so that we could eventually break the pipeline. So we're going to be making steel as that generates 58 degrees Celsius on the water temperature. And by doing so, we're going to eventually boil the water, loop it into itself so that it breaks. So if you guys do fill up your meta refinery all the way, you guys may need to deconstruct the pipes because you're going to have a full output pipe. So it's not going to be able to fill back in. So you might need to have plumbing to remove the water if you do overfill your meta refinery on the first time. But the goal is going to be breaking our pipes. So you could also put in hotter liquid so that on one pass through, it's going to actually break immediately. But to achieve the goal, we're going to underfill our meta refinery, have the pipe break and let it be broken. Now, once that's complete, you could actually connect your actual water line into your meta refinery. Of course, you could use any liquid of your choice. Doesn't really matter what it is, but you will need to constantly fill this up with a liquid. So it depends on what you have a lot of, whatever you have in abundance. Now, once this happens, that's the exploit, believe it or not. And let me explain what's going on. We're going to show you guys iron to steel, and we're going to set that to forever. So this game, it's really weird. The meta refinery building in and of itself, the content seemed to be in a alternative dimension. And what I mean by that is there is seemingly infinite space inside of the meta refinery and the contents right here that's in this list is not ever going to react with our environment that we're playing on. So this means that somehow magically we're always going to be able to make steel infinitely as long as we have a liquid medium we're pumping in. And if we keep this pipeline broken, None of the hot water actually leaves the system. As you can see, we have 1.1 kilograms of hot water at 104 degrees, not turning into steam, not breaking anything. And this allows you to use your meta refinery with a very cheesy strat as long as you want without having to deal with the hot heat that comes with smelting the metals. A lot of the times, the heat comes from the hot liquid from the output pipe so by doing this, you avoid dealing with the heat mechanic almost entirely. Now, of course, the meta refinery building also generates heat on itself. So you may have to cool this down a little bit because you're going to be running this literally constantly. As long as your water is able to fill up fast enough, you could see that we're waiting for the new water to pump in. But the meta refinery building is going to start generating heat. So I will say watch out for that. But this has been the Meta Refinery Chief Strat. As you can see, this is going up to 2,700 kilograms. And this is never going to have a limit. As long as you have water to input to this, this is always going to work. But of course, if you guys have any questions about this, leave a comment down below. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video. And of course, don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you guys.